This is a tale of a time-traveling family charged with protecting the course of time. Our adventure began with a young woman's return home after a separation decades earlier. Her return triggered a series of events challenging her faith in the family she so desperately wanted to belong to. With every twist and turn, she fell deeper and deeper down the rabbit hole, uncovering one secret after another. Until one day, she uncovered a secret that pushed her away from her newfound family. Starting a sequence of events foretold in prophecies from the Book of Oracles. Everybody, old love here, and welcome back to Flux Family Secrets. This time it's the Book of Oracles. Um, this is the third and final game, I think. Um, and stuff just keeps appearing here, which is concerning. So let's jump into this game and see what it has to offer. Chapter 1 Back to the Future. <clears throat> Please don't sue. Jess's unexpected return to her childhood resurfaced feelings of alienation. Her attempts to re reconnect with her family fell short. Eager to return to her old life in the future, Jess hastily activated the Apollo, triggering an intense time ripple that blasted her further into the past. Hearing a plea from her mother just moments before the blast, Jess must try to return to the future. Mom, save what? I need to get back, but where am I? Okay, we are in a bedroom of some sort. Uh, looks like, yeah, there's Grandpa Luc Lucio with the Wright brothers. Uh, okay, that's not good, I don't think. Welcome back, Jess. You weren't, we weren't expecting you again so soon, but there's been another ripple in time. Your grandfather, Luce Lucenti, left a recording for you in the event that you returned. Use our phonograph to play the recording. We hope it helps you. We hope it helps you. Orville and I will be back from our trip once we acquire a new type of block for our printing press. Good luck, Wilbur Wright. So this is the Wright brothers. Oh no, how'd I trigger another time ripple? I need to find that recording for answers. Yeah, I, I know, I, I don't really need that, thank you. Okay, there we go. So we've got a thumb latch. I bet it will become... So, yeah, we've got a lot of stuff to pick up here. Sybil. I didn't think the Wrights had any children. Sybil is a nice name, though. Yeah, I don't think that's the uh, a, a name of one of their children, exactly. I just, I really don't think that's what they're going for there. Because wasn't like, wasn't that like the, the, the writer of the book of oracles or somebody that was, you know, some part of the family stuff was the Sybil. So yeah, we have a thumb latch. That'll help us open the door. Yes. Yes, yes, I know all that. I told you to turn off the hints. It's 
nothing like saying, no, I don't want your hints. Oh, you're going to have the hints. Whether you want them or not, you're going to take them. It's like, no, I don't need the hints. I don't want your hints. I know how to play these games. I have played more than my fair share of them in the pa in, in my time. Uh, that, that, that's not good. We really screwed some stuff up here, didn't we? Okay, so we need to pry that out. Can we pry it out with the umbrella? Yes, we can. You're in quite a pickle, Jesse. You've triggered a ripple that dislodged the mansion from time, just as the Oracle foretold. If Sybil is right, then I need to get you back to your mother at the mansion just moments before the malfunction. I prepared an encrypted note for you on the printing press. Be safe, my dear. I'll try. Oh, how the hell did they hide that in there? Like seriously, how did you hide a printing a, a printing block in there that nobody could number one that nobody found, but more to the point that still enabled the sound to come out normally. All right, so we have a key. So we'll open that. That'll get us printer's ink. Fantastic. Okay, so we still need some stuff here. All right, so we need a printer's block. One printer's block and some spokes and... Hi. Okay, so we need a nickel. So we still need one more block in, and then we put them in there, okay. There we go, okay. So now we have all of the printer's blocks, the type blocks, so we should be able to put that in there, put. All right, there we go. So now we've got them all in the proper order. Now we need to, oh no, we need to ink that, put the paper in, and then roll it. That gives us the, the note. You have to hurry. You don't have much time. I'm sorry, who are you? What? Yeah, I'm with you there, Jess. Who the hell was that? I, I, I am so confused at this point. Was, was that the Sybil? That everybody's like going on about and stuff? Okay, so there is our translator. Within the walls of the workshop is a time portal. It's been calibrated to return you to the mansion moments before the explosion. Find the portal key. It resembles an owl. And place it on the base to activate it. I've hidden a critical piece inside the kinetoscope, next to the door. Play the movie to open the compartment door. Hurry, dear. Your journey has just begun, Lucente. Okay, I was gonna say, I'm like, are you gonna give me the nickel to play it? Because... I didn't bring any money. Flex Family Secrets, the ripple effect. Jess searches to find her identity led to her led her to a mansion with intriguing inhabitants.
Challenged to prove her pedigree, Jess uncovered a secret that propelled her into the past. Charged with correcting a ripple in time. While fixing the ripple in time, she uncovered and stopped her sister's deception, which sent her back to her childhood. Just came to the aid of her grandfather to fix the Apollo, the mechanism that enables time travel. Jess unknowingly stumbled upon her mother giving her sister a mysterious amulet and warning her not to trust Jess. Feeling betrayed, Jess hastily activated the Apollo to try to return back to her old life, causing a malfunction that dislodged the mansion from time and separated her from her family. The end? Before you depart, your grandfather wanted me to give you this. You must be going now. Good luck. So what, what was that? Tell the goddess, fall, okay, part of a note. So yes, time portal key. We're, holy Kripoli, what the hell happened? I'm back at the mansion. But have I arrived in time to undo my own mess? I can't open the door. All right, well, that is all the time we have for today, and that's the end of the current chapter. We'll start the next chapter uh, next time, obviously, and find out how Jess is going to help solve the problem that she created. As always, thank you guys very much for watching, and don't forget to put the subscribe button down below uh, so that you can stay tuned. For more from Olav Productions. If you want to see some crazy Here you should meet me and my friends. It is believed the Tinderbox grants three wishes to its owner. It would be disastrous if Rasputin were to gain possession of this artifact. He has tripled his fortune in only two months. His business sparkles as brilliantly as his diamonds.